Adio, Welcome Bar Club, Big Bart Bash. Hello, down there. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah, it's just yeah up here. Hello, yeah, it's me. It's Bill from uh, Bill Hello. Making Stuff, and uh, I think I'm a big disembodied head at the moment. But that's that's not important. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Uh, I'm here to invite you to the Big Bot Bash. Oh, what is the Big Bot Bash? You are. I can't really hear you from up here. I'll assume you said what is the Big Bot Bash. Basically, no, it's a big YouTube collaboration where we take this junk bot generator. There you go, you take that, you roll a dice, you get your little prompts, and you build a robot using those prompts. You can interpret them however you like. Yeah. Build a bot, make a video. You know, stick it all in a playlist, everyone can see each other's. You know how a YouTube collaboration works. So, you know, any questions? No. Let's go! Uh, oh, no. Yes. <laughs> Time to clean up first. Yes, yes, yes. Let's clean this mess. Finally. Now I'm hot. <laughs> Sweating. Uh, finally, we can start. Let's see. I collected some stuff, some rubbish, cool plastic bits. Uh, yeah. I'll spread it out on the table. Spread. For you. Spread. Only for you. You, 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 and you. That is a lot of junk. <sighs> Where to start? How to start? I think I go with the torso first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, let's make some room. Trying out different plastic pieces. Always need to sand them, otherwise color and stuff won't stick. Glues. I like to pin stuff. Super glue and baking soda welding stuff together. Also makes a good glove, a crusty glove on your fingers. Now it's time to add some details to the basic shape of the torso. Just using some old cables. Yes. That's the cool thing about sci-fi builds. You can use all the plastic and the electronic parts and cables and stuff. Really funky thing. Sanding. S -s 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 sanding Stop the city, bro. Stop it. Stop it. Please stop it. Folks don't like it. Now we got like the it. torso, we got two arms. Let's work on the back. It's more the sh shoulders. Yeah, bubblegum shoulders. Bubblegum plastic housing shoulders. I'm using different kinds of glues. This is uh, construction adhesive, using mm. also super glue, hot glue. In this build, I don't use any PVA. Yes, I use PVA later on. I didn't know how to connect those two pieces, so I'm using XPS. I make an indent and then carve the XPS foam to fit the plastic part. And then I uh, rub some, uh, this is the construction adhesive, uh, to, to fill in the gaps, carving some holes where I can put the torso in. Torso. Needs more carving. And some glue, of course. 
The construction ad adhesive also seals in the XPS so it doesn't melt away when you spray paint it or put glue on it. Other glue, like super glue. Those uh, network cable sockets make cool sockets for our legs. Oh, that was one in the mouth. It's too long here. Yeah, it's too long. It's far too long, man. Let's work on the feet. The feet are thick wires twisted together and then I'll put some plastic tubing on top of the wires. Some details, zip ties, really tiny zip ties. I'm gluing the legs into the network sockets with the hot glue that takes ages to cool down and uh, actually stick. So this guy has four legs, the spidey legs I rolled, and he's running a little bit. One, one foot is up in the air, gluing the shoulder back part to the torso. This adhesive takes a long time to set, but when it sets, it's bombastic. I'm using some thick thread as uh, cables. Looking good so far, but I guess soon we need a hat. But before that, I'll add some more details. Mm. So this hat is too small. Mm. You got a bigger one? Is there a bigger one? This head is far too big, and then I went to the garage and found this. <laughs> and that's perfect. I like it. I rolled up the theme Ronin, so I wanted a hat and a kind of a cape. So what's the mask for, you ask? I'm uh, melting or I'm softening up the tube so I can shape the arms. I bent them while making them hot and that's, yeah, nasty fumes, you know. So the mini can make a dub, dub. My hands are hooks from the sheet. I just took hooks. <laughs> yeah, some decoration on the feet. 
<laughs> Long break. <laughs> Had the mini standing around for like one to two weeks. So let's finish it up. All the others are <sighs> finishing their minis. They got cool stuff, cool stuff, cool stuff. So I gotta, yeah. Brat, brat. Here it is. It's a giant. <laughs> Uh, let's go senegal on it. So while I was procrastinating on other stuff, the rest of the gang are posting their beauty shots and their finished minis and stuff and then hoo ha hoo I get uh, anxious and let's paint this sucker up. Red. Try something. This is tile grout. Beige tile grout. Oh, that's a little bit much. On the wet paint. And then some uh, water to activate. This is 70% isopropanol and some Indian ink. Uh, my friend uh, from N-Scale Dystopia uses this technique and I wanted to try it out. I usually use water in the ink. It stinks like hell, like isopropanol, of course. Um, it behaves a little bit different. Silver dry brushing for highlights. We need some contrast. Everything is tone and tone now. We got the, the dark tone is this uh, reddish, rusty brown tone. We got highlights. So I want, I want real darkness. Darkness. Dark. You should bring darkness into this. Darkness. Yeah, black speed paints. Better. Yeah, so now we need some color. Red speed paint. Now it looks like an house. Knocking on house. Blue regular paint. Blue eyes. Okay, I can't paint like this. The image looks great, but I go like this. Ew. Filming mini painting is... It's even worse with the small minis. So I got the Ronin theme going on. So I'm thinking uh, of doing some cloth. Like this and like this maybe. I'm using real cloth for the cloth. So here the PVA comes into play with black color, soaking it. And then, uh, yeah, trying to dry it. <laughs> Sometimes life is... Yeah, this works now. Now, after it's dry, it's rock hard, and I can use super glue to glue it to the bigature, miniature, whatever you want to call it, but. I like this big one. Big, 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 big for the big bomb bash. Here's some more cloth for the, let's call it skirt, and for the cloak. PVA and black color again. 
Massaging it in, massaging it in. So this will be the cloak, it's blue, with the beige patterns on it. To bring everything in form, I use tons and tons and tons of hairspray and then drying again with a hair blower, hair dryer, and then a hairspray again and then hair dryer, hairspray, hair dryer, hairspray. Blah, 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 blah. As usual, thanks to all my Patreons. You may join us uh, over at Patreon. We got a free Discord where we can chat. Now check out all the cool other videos. The others made so great bots that's crazy good, crazy good, crazy good. Yeah.